Dominica, no, not that island. This Dominica is located between Guadalupe and Martinique in the Lesser Antilles. And it's a destination that you must add to your travel list. The island was first settled by the Arawak in the 5th century and the Kalanago in the 15th century. It was later colonized by the French and eventually the English. The island's diverse ethnic background is largely made up of indigenous Amerindian and Afro-Caribbean people. The food is also a perfect mix of fresh seafood, wild game, and fruit. Known as the nature island of the Caribbean and the island of 365 rivers, Dominica is also known for its magnificent waterfalls and lush green mountainous rainforests. After a quick three hour flight from Miami, we arrived in Dominica and began our trip with a street food tour on our way to Portsmouth on the western side of the island. I won't lie to you, this is the hardest country to pronounce. Here, follow me. How you doing? Oh, I can't wait. Let's see what you got here. Natural liberty. David, pleasure. Nice to meet you. <laughs> <laughs> so it's good. It's everything um, natural and local oh, over here. This is great. Some grilled plantain, some um, toasted coconuts. Toasted coconuts. Yeah. Look at this. So, Incredible. It's, it's all natural. It's all fresh. It's all good. And how do we eat this? So you just um, you just eat your coconut. I just 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 purely that. Okay. You just have your um, toasted coconut. Hold on. Oh, fantastic. Okay. And I also serve it in um, the banana leaf. So in a banana leaf. Planting in a banana leaf. Wow. Any sauces or just like this? Just, just natural. 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 Yes. Fantastic. So you got some beautiful avocado. Look at this. Right. Nice and ripe already. Look at that. Oh, this one's like too much. This is like ready to eat right now. <laughs> right under the. Oh lime yeah, right under the lime tree. Look at this beautiful lime tree on top of us. I also do roasted breadfruit. Oh guys, guys, this is the best. This, this is, is this is our, um, natural foods that we have in Dominica. This is my favorite thing in the Caribbean right here. Roasted breadfruit and saltfish. So I had it in Guyana, I had it in Trinidad, Barbados as well. <laughs> right here we got it. Yes. Okay, so we're gonna have some of this. Perfect. Street food in Dominica. We're gonna have it right here on the on that. Okay, perfect. Yeah, right on the banana leaf. Ooh, nice and toasty. <laughs> Smoky, too. <laughs> yep. All right, so I guess I'll try one. Mmm. Warm. Mm-hmm. Yep. I've never had it before. Yeah. Mmm. It's, it's crunchy. Copra. Mmm, nice and dense. We locally call it here as copra. Copra. That's they used to do the, um, the soap, our blue soap. Mm hmm They used to do it oil. We do locally coconut oil as well, a lot. Even though it's been here smoking, mm -hmm. You still have a lot of taste of coconut. Yeah. Still has all the um, oil. They wow. They have all the oil in there. Yes. Oh, yep. fantastic. And then Glad next to it. I'm enjoying it. I wanted to have you taste the toasted coconut as well. Oh, yeah. It's, the, um, drive, it's your driver. Yeah. yeah. Bongo. Thank you. It was amazing. Um, I want you to treat them and show them how, how you do the coconut. The, the, the jelly nuts. Yeah, we want some jelly nuts. Oh, you're going to do it right yes. now? So we have some yes. fresh She's jelly nuts. She's going to be cutting. Oh. Yep. Well, hey, look. This is what you get when you come to Dominica. This is the freshest of all waters. Anything you can get is coconut water. <laughs> Nectar <laughs> of the gods right there. <laughs> so good. Yep, what they say, they, um, it's full of um, neutralites. Mm -hmm. So that's Electrolytes. what you get for electrolytes. That's what you get for energy. Mm. Yep, that's good. So I will mm. um, just cut you one so you can have one of our coconut water. I'm in love with this though, man. And this is our green banana. Mm -hmm. Our culture fig. <laughs> we call it a green fig. So yeah. these aren't sweet, right? No. This is the sweet one. This is the green one. Okay, so over here we have sweet one. Sweet ones. Over here we have green ones. Green ones. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. Mm. Love it. Fantastic. Have to try this. The smokiness. This so is this like is, tropical smoky feel. This is roasted plantain. Mm. This is roasted plantain, and this is our ripe plantain so this is when it's not roasted culture food this is what you eat when you get hungry you just roast it right on the fire have it for lunch have it for dinner on, and that's it God, yes <laughs> oh, i'll try hold on a minute nicole hold on a minute oh take okay. the block mm. and bring it here oh all right yeah oh, let's yeah. take the block oh this is so good it reminds me of maduro okay. sweet plantain yeah, put the but there. it's not sweet yes. Mm. Yes. so it's ripe mm -hmm. and um this is yeah. how it look when it's green that's perfect this is green, so this is some green planting. So right here we have the green one. Yeah. So this from this to this to this. To this. <laughs> I'll say, I mean, it has a little bit of sweetness. Mm-hmm. Right. Mm. Oh, wow. 
This with some cheese. Oh. So I serve this with peanut butter or Nutella chocolate. What? Yeah. Where's the peanut butter? Yeah, I have Nutella chocolate. You have Nutella chocolate? Yeah. I like this though. Natural. <laughs> Natural. Jelly coconuts. There you go. Yeah. Ooh. That fast, huh? Who first? So here we go, here we go. Sweet. That's what you say. Um, say ball. Ball. Say my ball. My ball. <laughs> my ball. <laughs> say deuce. Say deuce. Oh, oh. <laughs> right there for bongo. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Nate, you want some? That is good like mama's you you? Mm. That is That's good really good. Like That's really good, good. yeah. Mmm. <laughs> Say bo, oh, yeah. say sweet. Oh, yeah. Sajou. Yeah, sajou. Yeah, say, say, Very say, refreshing. Say Saudi, say glow coco. Glow coco, sajou. We are in the month of our independence, and this is how we say it. We say this as in our dialect, glow coco. Glow coco. <laughs> glow coco, glow coco, I like it. Glow coco. We are in our independence month. Eh? This is where we celebrate our, um, our culture of our independence. And this is our what year of independence? Remind me. I think this is uh, it was seventy eight or seventy nine. Yeah. I forgot exactly. Seventy nine. Oh well, this thing is filling, huh? So yeah. much. Yeah. Okay. okay, perfect. You had all? You just? I drink it all. Yeah, yeah. I think I did. So one open. Whoa! <laughs> Amazing. Oh, you're doing another one. One open. <laughs> You're amazing. Thank you so much. Cane juice cocktail? Yeah. What cane juice cocktail, man? Right on the spot. Right on the spot. Take the seats out. First time I'm trying cane juice cocktail. I usually just try cane juice on the street. Sugar cane. Yeah, yeah. Pure, right? This is pure? Yeah. Don't add any more sugar to sugar, no, 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 cane. No, 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 sugar. Pure. I guess I'll try it here. Let me get in this in the in the sun right here. <laughs> That's amazing. Mm, perfect. The lime juice. Oh, the lime juice. Yeah, lime juice. Oh, the sugar cane. That was so refreshing in this heat, and it's not even that hot. Yeah, it's not that bad, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's not. It's not that bad. But the humidity. The humidity. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like Miami. It's like it's 80, but it feels like 100. You good, Nate? Yeah, I'm great. I just think he kind of looks like a German Shepherd kind of a dog. Sort of, sort of. She mixes, I think. She yeah, it mixes. Uh, hey. Good night. That's really good. Wow. Really good. Yeah, it's really, really tasty. Thank, Thank you so much. Yeah. Really fresh. It's so good. I don't remember seeing you up here, but I know you, folks. Yeah, I know you on that ride. I know you. Uh, your face, what? And you know that face by. When you bring up, um, you go by Curtis. It's a trap. Oh, my family had pack. Okay, 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 okay. Call you. Okay, great. Maybe just said. All right, yes, 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 yes. All right. I let up the van at the back of um. I give all the jellies up there. Yes, yes, yes. Good. Oh, is the name of that um of your firm? I look nice. So have some more. Yes, it's not too much. Just grab a little bit right there. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> Woo! Hot. Stop. Can I have one more piece of coconut? <laughs> Let's have mm -hmm. some stuffing at natural, natural liberty. Hope to see you again. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yep. Amazing. Yeah. Mm. Guys, it's only about 10 minutes from the airport. So good. Thank you so much. You're welcome. So plantains, coconuts, toasted coconuts, banana leaves, banana leaves, avocado, sugar cane, avocado, cocoa, jelly nut, breadfruit, <laughs> and puppies. Love you, Dominica. <laughs> Thank you so much. Appreciate it. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're welcome. All right, let's do it. Mm. Good dog. Is that a toasted coconut? That was good, bro. In my life, I've ever had a toasted coconut. It's like smoky. Yeah, it was. Oh, really good. so delicious. All right, Bongo, let's rock and roll. He has a restaurant? <laughs> He's just like, come film. <laughs> Thank you, bye bye. All right, let's go, guys. I'm excited. Look at this view. Roadside restaurant with this view. Look at this. I haven't even arrived. 
10 a.m. I had breakfast in Miami. I'm having lunch here in Dominica. Incredible, look at that. What a view. Hey guys, what are we doing? What's happening? So we're having like a little show saying that um, they don't really have anything that can feature like food wise. No food? No, not, not right. really. You have a drink? You have a drink? All right, so unfortunately right now they don't have anything cooking, so we're gonna keep going and find some more food. I'm starving, literally starving. Yeah, you will. I just have some tender coconut. <laughs> I'm the young phone, I tried to call you. So long, girl. All right. Just making stops all along the road. This is awesome. This is not a highway. This is a very curvy road along this beautiful country. Here we go. How you doing, my friend? Everything good? What do we have today? Oh, I just have some turkey lunch. We may have some rice and peas, some baked macaroni. A little provision and some turkey remain and local juices. Local juices? Yes. Um, passion fruit, guava, and sorrel. The best fruit on the planet comes from this island. That's what I heard. That's what I heard. Yes, so you have passion fruit, sorrel? Yeah, and, and guava. I hope I was and guava. Okay. So we'll try some fruit. I mean, some juices? Yeah. And then maybe some provision. Let me see. A little of everything. A little bit. Yeah, yeah. yeah okay, I have to come here on, on, on Saturday. You want Saturday open? Oh, not this Saturday. This Saturday is my son's birthday. Okay. Whole different ball game. <laughs> it's a whole different ball game. So. Let me see that turkey. That gravy, guys. Oh, wow. Oh, sir. Two of them. Your friend eating as well. Oh, I'm actually okay. I, I ate this morning. You ate this morning? Yeah, I told you, man. Oh, okay. I'll taste. I'll have a taste. You'll just have a taste. Okay. That looks amazing. Yes. Wow, it's going to rain right now. Anything local to drink? Yes, whatever you recommend. Um, you want to try the sorrel? Let's try sorrel. Sorrel, yeah. I like sorrel. I had a. Had it already? In Guyana, I had sorrel with like a cake. Kima. Oh, Kima. So I'm going to try some of this delicious sorrel. So this is an incredible drink. How do I open this? Oh, there we go. I've never seen it before like this. It's different. Can you open it up? Perfect. Like a little off top. Mm -hmm. Oh, nice. Mm -hmm. It's sweet, it's refreshing. Mm -hmm. mm, feels like almost like cinnamon in here, you know? There is cinnamon and nutmeg in there. Oh, there is cinnamon and nutmeg. In there as well. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. It's good stuff. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is so tasty. Look at that. Beautiful sorrel. So I've had sorrel in uh, Trinidad and I've had it in Guyana and now in Dominica. But uh, in Guyana, I had it in a cake, and it's like a hot cake. Oh, and in Trinidad, you had it in a drink. In a drink, and here in a drink again. And we're going to try this. Is it okay if I try it right here? Sure. It's okay with you? Mm -hmm. Let's try this. Sorry, guys, the rain's nuts. Sorry, I'm going to get right here. Oh, look at this. Look at this beauty right here. <laughs> so we have... Sorry, the vegetables are gone already. So I, most things are done. Coffee. I know, I know. Mmm. It's a turkey, right? Yes. Mmm. Oh, I love this gravy. Thank you. Oh, so good. So you mix that with the rice, right? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, fantastic. Mmm. Right. Not too many spices in here, right? No. Mm -hmm. We also have the mac and cheese mixed with the gravy. Mm-hmm. Mmm. -hmm. Nice, rich gravy. Oh yeah, let's pick this up. Mm -hmm. Lots of bones. That's so how you know it's real, right? Heavy duty. Get some of that. What is this? Mm -hmm. It's a root vegetable. Hey, what is this one? Let me see. That, that's um, taru, dashin. Oh, it's taru, dashin. Dashin, yeah. And this one's plantain, right? Yeah, it looks like you're throwing that down, boy. Wow. Wow, I'm hungry. I'm tasty, eh? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So fresh. I want the whole... And what you should do, do to dip it in here. Oh, yeah, what do you see up there? Uh, sorry, I'm going to pass Mm-hmm. Did the rain pass? Sort of, right? Good. You got some of that meat, huh? Oh, thank you. I'm sorry I'm in your way. No problem. There's nowhere else to be right now because it's raining. No problem. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah. And this is how roadside restaurants are? Yeah. In Dominica? Oh. I love it. Thank really quick, you. just come, order what, what's available, take it to go. Hello. Hi. Mm -hmm. um, you are alone? Five it's great. I love the taro. By the plantain. I'm sure you dip that right here. Yeah, yeah, of course. So you do this every day? Yes, every day. Right? Every day. Yeah. I love it. Thank you. Mm -hmm. mm. When food is made from the heart, it's delicious. Mm -hmm. Yep. I'm literally in her way here. I'll, I'll leave. I'll leave. <laughs> With your umbrella. How you doing, Good? This is what I wanted. A real local experience, right? I mean, what can I tell you? With rain, is always a problem. You know? Yes. Always, always. That's true. Mm hmm. I think what makes your dish is that gravy. Mm hmm. The turkey gravy? I'm sorry. Your son's in the car, right? He's here? Is he good? Yeah. He's so happy. Look at him. He's so happy. Great home cooked food. Mm hmm. So every day, what, every day, what do you usually make? Uh, different meals. Sometimes I have pork, I have goat. Well, I usually have fish and chicken. Fish and chicken? Fish and chicken happens every day. But then it's like turkey one day, pork, goats, those type of things. Oh, and Bongo's enjoying. And I destroyed my food. Yeah. Sort of lost half of it. Uh, the French call it hibiscus. That's why we like it so much because we, we know what it is. We just what forgot. <laughs> the problem is all over these countries, different languages, different names for, different, for the same thing, you know? So, same thing happens in India. 20 different languages, 20 different names for the same dish. The Pomerac, that's another one. The Pomerac? They call it a cashew in one place and they call it uh, all of those things. Pomerac and mother. Yeah, yeah. Well, my friend, thank you so much. No problem. So what do we owe you? Um, 45. 45 total. So yeah. two people ate, you didn't eat. No. Good. So two meals, 45. What is it, the exchanger right now? I don't even it's know. three to one. Three, three to one? one. It's, two, it's 2. So 2.75. About 15 US. One dollar is 2.75 of their currency. Cool. Got it, got it, got it. I just food. We will. Folks, bye. Thank you so I'm much. You Take guys. care. Yeah. Bye. Okay. Woo! Raining crazy right now. This, this is the island though. Lots of wet days. What's up guys? <laughs> <laughs> it's not me. What the foreigners? Up here. Very interesting. There's some old French families here, bro. I don't know if you, they're like um, from yeah. the old days. Yeah. So, so what do we got here? We got cooking, the bear choice from Dominica, it's locally made. There you go. You drink this and you will never be thirsty again. <laughs> never be thirsty again? No. Let's open it. I have this, I have to. All right, here we go. Hey, cheers guys, cheers. 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 Kubali. Oh my gosh, but I'm sure she's bringing something else. Mmm, uh -huh. nice. Yeah, nice. Limited independent edition. Oh, I like that. Oh, so there's a limited uh, logo right there yes, of, the, of, the, of this label. Yeah, yeah. Incredible. Dominica's mm -hmm. Pride. Kubali. Dominica's Pride. Kubali. <laughs> so how do we say amazing in, over here? Is there a different word? Amazing. Uh, Give me some different words. Give me some different words. Come on. Um, in Creole, you say... Up. No. I, say, in Creole, you say, say bon. Say bon. Uh -huh. Ah, say bon. Hey, hey, hey como está le vous? Como está le vous? And this right here is called Rainbow Restaurant. We're actually coming here on Saturday. We're gonna go get octopus right out here and some sea urchins. Incredible spot right here alongside the road. So Rainbow Restaurant by Caribbean Flavor Cuisine. And look at this, we got a little beach. You have the restaurant here. That's where we just had the beer. Love this spot. Incredible, what a beautiful day, huh? Well, not so beautiful, but beautiful setting, right? All right, let's go. Ikalinago people name the island Waitukubuli, right? And that has a meaning. The meaning of Waitukubuli is tall, is her body, right? And as you already know, we have a beer named the Kubuli beer. So the Kubuli is actually a break off from the name Waitukubuli. I'm going to help you remember the name. I'm going to give you a bad joke that will help you remember the indigenous name of the island. And the bad joke goes like this. A guy walks into a bar and he sees a Kalinago man having a conversation with the bartender. Then he hears the, the Kalinago man says to the bartender, Whitey Kubuli. Before the bartender could reply, the guy shouts, 
one is not enough so why two kubuli <laughs> okay <laughs> right that's bad because it actually works i gotta ask you questions so uh, christopher columbus came here and he's the one that named the island so from my understanding he called it dominica because yes, yes. in it was, it was discovered on a sunday on a sunday so in spanish it's domingo in italian it's dominica right so latin dominica dominica Sunday. Yes. Perfect. Sunday. Also, Dominican Republic is named after Sunday. Also. Yes. Well, but Dominican Republic was Saint was Dominic. Santo Domingo, right? And then they Santo changed Domingo it. Santo Domingo is after. Yeah, exactly. They changed they it. They shared the same route. Oh, it's gone. Yeah. This was flooded, bro. This was like a river right here on this bridge. This was a river. So yeah. yeah. So look at the driftwood. Did it go? Yeah. That driftwood. Yeah, that was right there. <sighs> wow. So why are you doing the whole bridge wide? Why are you doing the bloody road for? Oh, but the wind two hours can drive on the bridge. Hold your side, my brother. <laughs> but give back the money. Mo hey, take back your money for that license you buy. <laughs> he literally took half the road there, bro. Oh, yeah. What's wrong with that guy? There's 13 volcanoes in the Caribbean. Eight are located here in Dominica. Incredible. And right here we have the sun setting, sort of, right? Because it's mountains, so yeah. it's like going and coming. What is that? Is that a pig? Where? Oh, there's one of the rats right yes, there. Yes. Is he there? I don't see it. Nah, he's, I think he's gone, man. So it takes around an hour to get from the airport to Portsmouth. Portsmouth is this, the biggest city, but it's not the capital. What's the no, capital? It's not the biggest city. It's Roseau, the Roseau. Oh, Roseau. Actually, what you need to know is Portsmouth was the first capital of Dominica. Okay. But it was changed by the British because the early settlers, um, because um, Portsmouth has a lot of surrounding swampland, Got they it. were afraid of contacting malaria, so they moved the um, city to Roseau. Now, Roseau, the capital of Dominica, is named after the Roseau Reed. The Roseau Reed essentially is like the wild sugar cane. Um, today we use Roseau Reed for roofing, fencing, arts and crafts, baskets, and the likes, essentially for arts and crafts. You know? So, Roseau was populated with that wild sugar cane and they had to cut it down for um, thing. Now the neighboring um, village to um, Roso is called Canefield. And like the name depicts, it was a huge cane field. Today we still have the old main cultural center where that's where they used to grind the cane, the cane and stuff. They have some ruins there. Um, it's a cultural center as I say. When we go up to Roso side, we're gonna stop there and see what's going on. It's the month, the cultural month, uh, Ministry of um, culture and youth affairs yeah. they actually have a, they have a branch in there so we can go there and get some so this is the month to come october this is like the creole mm -hmm. food month right from yes. my understanding yes um you know i'm going to be here for five full days we're going to be exploring um basically the whole island we're going to uh, try maniku we're going to try some octopus over here what's over here this is like a okay. That's all grapevines. Oh, this is nice. Yeah, yeah it's beautiful Chinese. gardens. Yeah, the Chinese have that. Um, Chinese. Yes. And this is you, man. This that's is you it. up here. Up, up here. Up here, that's you. So you did see Paul Baron. Paul. Hi, man. How you doing, man? Everything good? good. All right. So Paul's my super host. Hi. What you mean? You good, man? Pretty good. What are you guys? I'm excited. So this is our spot right here, right? And right here is the lighthouse. This is where I'm staying on this incredible trip. So my unit is first floor. I have an incredible view over the Caribbean. Next, that's the Caribbean. It's West Coast, right? We're in the West Coast. Look at this, my friends. Wow, sun is setting. Beautiful, just the waves crashing. Go up a little more. Wow, this is just gorgeous, huh? Mountains. Nice and calm, not that many people, not too loud. Here we go, so house rules, shoes off. All right, and as soon as you enter here, look at this, we have an incredible living room, right? Beautiful living room, very nice and spacious, modern. Look at this, marble, got bongo over there, chilling. Uh, we have everything here in terms of kitchen, if you wanna just chill here, and not go out to eat, you can bring, you know, everything in. Breakfast, lunch, and dinner, you can make everything. There's two rooms, right? So, got the first room right here. Spacious, this is where Nate's staying. Sorry, Nate, joking. 
So right here we have washer dryer right here. Washer dryer. We have, oh, I love this bathroom. I didn't even see the bathroom. Oh, this is nice. Oh, I can't wait, can't wait for this. And then over here, we have the master, right? Master bedroom. We have a closet. We have a nice queen size bed. What do you have, a telescope here? Like, what is this, dude? This is incredible for the stars. And then come out over here, go to the very end, unlock this. I cannot wait to hear the waves crashing in the morning. It is great. What a view, huh? So we're gonna be here for the next, um, I think six nights, right? So we got Tuesday through Sunday, whatever that is. And yeah, this is our home. Incredible, just love it. Beautiful, and that's sort of our day, right? So we had a super short day. I arrived here at 1.30 from Miami, so 10 a.m. flight, arrived here at 1.30 in the afternoon, got in the car and just stopped along the way on that main road, right? So we have a lot of different street food vendors. You have plantains, you have coconut, uh, they have provisions, they have turkey, and just a big mix of things on the road. You can also find some coconut vendors, unfortunately for today. It was raining, so we didn't see any, but then we made it all the way here to Port's Mouth. Right, so this is where we're staying. I love it. I can't wait to explore Dominica, 93rd country. And, and that's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed our first afternoon here in beautiful Dominica, an island in the Caribbean that is not Dominican Republic. I can't wait to show you everything about this island. I'm going to be here till Sunday. We're going to do a lot of different things, waterfalls, street food, got bush food. I'm excited. Guys, if you love the video, please give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment below. Subscribe to my channel for more awesome travel content and definitely book this place. It's on Airbnb.